Hey guys, Kevin here and welcome back again to another video on the Trainer Tale YouTube channel. This is the third recording in a row I'm doing. Once again, we are back with a shiny hunting location. And as you can see from the location I'm at now, it is right after I've recorded the Solosis, but we are shiny hunting for Beldum today. So just a quick one before we get into today's video. We have just launched our first Discord server, so the links are in the description below for you to join. Plenty of different rooms in there to interact with us and other people. And we will also be doing giveaways in there, which you don't want to miss. So make sure to head down, press the link, and join the server. So like I said, we are hunting Beldum today, and this location does spawn Beldum and Matang. And the location you want to go is to the polar biome, and we are heading here. So once you get here, you'll see a structure like this. And you'll see a big rock to the left of it. You are in the right location if you see this. And as always, we are using the sandwich boost to shiny hunt today. So what you want to do first is you want to save your game. Just because the shiny isn't guaranteed straight away, Herb Mystica is still hard to get on this game. So if you don't find the shiny and you've saved the game, you can reset it and reuse the same Herb Mystica until you get the shiny. When you've done that, head straight into your picnic and we are using the psychic boost again. I haven't tried using steel for Beldum, so feel free to use that. I couldn't tell you if it works or not, but the onions work great in this location. So your sandwich doesn't have to look anything amazing. Just make sure nothing falls off. Again, if something does fall off, restart your game because you've saved it. Don't try and play through because you will not get the correct boosts. So restart your game, rebuild the sandwich again. It's not a sandwich which is too hard to build, so you shouldn't really struggle with it. But once it's done, you will see the boost at the end. So as you can see, we've done everything correctly. So you can see sparkling power, title power, and encounter power for psychic all level three. So straight away, as you look around, you will see plenty of Beldum spawning in along with Matang. Beldum is a silvery looking color without it being shiny so it's a pretty hard shiny to spot especially being in the snow so just make sure to take your time i probably wouldn't go on your riding pokemon for this one just because you might miss one so just keep an eye out for the shiny what i like to do is head around this big rock here again taking your time letting the game load new spawns in keep an eye out for every single one but as you can see plenty do spawn in but that is everything you need to know to be able to shiny hunt yourself a beldum in order to get the shiny metagross if you don't get it straight away or in the first sandwich again just be patient you will get it eventually just keep restarting again rebuilding your sandwich and following this method the best luck in your shiny hunts and i hope to see you again in the near future